GPT is being used for some of the most advanced crimes imaginable. The undetectable virus. On April 5th, 2023, Reddit user Bosco Broski revealed that ChatGPT banned him from his own Minecraft server. Bosco was using a program that connected ChatGPT to his Minecraft server. The AI chatbot acted as the server's admin and could take action based on the player's messages. Bosco Broski didn't say what caused his ChatGPT to ban him, but this incident shows its incredible power. ChatGPT doesn't just type out messages, it understands programming languages like Python. Its ability to code is so advanced that some programmers are worried it might take over their jobs. To give you an idea of how significant this is, programming languages are how computers communicate. They're usually difficult for humans to understand, but for an AI like ChatGPT, programming comes naturally. In fact, it comes so naturally that AI can take instructions written by people who don't know how to code and turn it into programming that works. And it can do this with very little mistakes. On December 21st, 2022, a ChatGPT user shared his first ever programming script on an online forum. It wasn't long before other users realized that he used ChatGPT to produce the script, and he eventually admitted it. Which he emphasized was the first script he ever created. After commenters noted it resembled OpenAI code, the poster confirmed this assumption. But here's the problem. That script allows users to steal information from unsuspecting victims. And as soon as cybercriminals get their hands on the malware, it can then be shared on hacking forums. ChatGPT's content policy prevents it from creating malware directly, but like jailbreaking, these restrictions can be overridden. A cybersecurity researcher named Aaron Mulgrew got ChatGPT to create an undetectable virus. He got through ChatGPT's restrictions by instructing it to code different parts of the virus before he stitched it together. The 